For over 15,000 years, the domestic dog has been the most popular pet in the world. They are part of a family of carnivores called the canids, a group that also includes jackals, dingoes, and even foxes. Two of the best known canids are the gray wolf and the coyote. At first glance, they may look alike, and they do have a lot in common, but these two predators are actually quite different from one another. That's what we're here to explore today. So let's set out into the wild as we get to know wolves and coyotes. The wolf is found throughout much of Asia, the upper half of North America, and parts of Europe. In the past, the wolf's range spanned much farther. It was once found throughout most of the United States, Mexico, Western Europe, the British Isles, and Japan. Today, wolves are found mostly in remote, wild places. The coyote, on the other hand, is only found in North America. Before the wolf was exterminated throughout most of the United States, the coyote was found mainly in the grasslands and deserts of the American West. However, the loss of wolves in much of their original range allowed the coyote to expand well beyond its own range. Now the coyote can be found in almost any type of landscape. Unlike the wolf, the coyote has adapted very well to cities and neighborhoods. They have even been seen in major metropolitan areas like New York City. On at least one occasion, a coyote has wandered into Central Park. A wolf usually weighs between 70 and 150 pounds, and can grow to 32 inches high and 6.5 and feet long. By contrast, the coyote weighs between 15 and 50 pounds and measures about 2 feet high and 4 and a half feet long. The wolf has a broader face, while the coyote has longer ears. Overall, the coyote has a skinnier and lankier body than the wolf. Although wolves are well known for traveling in family groups known as packs, the social structures of coyotes are more varied. Some live solitary lives, others travel in pairs, and some form small family groups of their own. Even the sounds they make are more different than you might expect. The low, drawn-out howl of the wolf is one of the most recognizable sounds in the entire animal kingdom. The coyote will also howl, but at a much higher pitch and in shorter bursts. The wolf will bark, while the coyote yips. In some places, such as Yellowstone National Park, these two canids actually coexist. However, they generally do not get along well. Wolves are the more dominant species and will usually chase away any coyotes that come near their territory. On rare occasions, wolves have even been known to eat coyotes. This may be why wolf populations tend to be higher than coyote populations, where their ranges overlap. Although these predators don't usually have good relations, they have actually been known to crossbreed. A hybrid of a wolf and a coyote is called a koi wolf. Regardless of their differences, wolves and coyotes are close cousins, and both are amazing in their own way. Be sure to subscribe for more Wildlife Chronicles. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on our next adventure.